You've heard the rumors, right? That Pi Network is just another get-rich-quick scheme. Well, let's clear the air. Five years is a long time for a scam to operate under the radar. Scammers don't stick around that long. They get caught, exposed, and shut down. So what's Pi Network's secret? Let's dive in and find out together. By the end of this video, you'll be surprised. Promise. Hey, Pi Network community. It's your boy Aloys again with another awesome video. The crypto world is buzzing with excitement and Pi Network is at the center of it all. Today, we're diving deep into the latest developments that are shaping the future of our favorite mobile-first cryptocurrency. In this video, we'll cover one, game-changing updates to Pi Wallet, two, the latest on KYC progress, three, exciting developments in the migration process for Pi Network's move into DeFi, five, what you need to do next as a pioneer. So grab a cup of coffee and let's get started. You won't want to miss this. Pi Wallet, a leap forward in digital finance. Let's kick things off with the star of the show Pi Wallet. The core team has been working tirelessly to transform Pi Wallet into a powerhouse of digital finance, and the results are nothing short of impressive. First up, we've got the introduction of receive, withdraw, and exchange options. These might sound basic, but they're the building blocks of any robust digital wallet. With these features, you'll be able to accept Pi from transactions or other users, transfer your funds to external accounts, and convert Pi to other digital or fiat currencies. It's all about giving you more control over your Pi. But that's just the beginning. The team is planning to integrate automated transactions. Imagine setting up recurring payments for your subscriptions or bills, all handled automatically by your Pi wallet. No more forgetting to pay that monthly streaming service. And here's where it gets really interesting smart contracts are coming to Pi Wallet. For those of you scratching your heads, smart contracts are like digital agreements that execute automatically when certain conditions are met. They're a game changer in the crypto world, making transactions more secure and transparent. But wait, there's more. The Pi team is working on implementing AI-powered investment advice. Now, I'm not saying this will turn you into the next Warren Buffett overnight, but having AI analyze your transaction patterns and market trends to offer personalized investment suggestions, that's pretty cool. The Pi Wallet isn't just stopping at Pi either. Plans are in the works to support a variety of digital assets. We're talking other cryptocurrencies, NFTs, and even more complex financial products like tokenized stocks and digital bonds. It's like Pi Wallet is aiming to become your one-stop shop for all things digital finance. KYC progress the road to open mainnet. Now, let's talk about something that's been on everyone's mind, KYC. Know your customer. I know, I know, it's not the most exciting topic, but it's crucial for the network security and legitimacy. Here's the good news, Pi Network is making significant progress. They're nearing completion of KYC for 15 million users. That's a lot of verified pioneers, and they're not slowing down. The team is pushing hard to accelerate the KYC process to meet the open mainnet target. But why is KYC so important? Well, it's all about creating a safe and trustworthy ecosystem. By verifying user identities, Pi Network can prevent system abuse and ensure a fair distribution of Pi coins. It's like building a solid foundation for a house. It might not be the most exciting part, but it's essential for everything that comes after. Migration update, small wallets, big impact. Speaking of progress, have you heard the latest on the migration front? This is where things get really interesting. Pi Network has opened up migrations for wallets with balances under one Pi. Now, you might be thinking, so what? Well, this is actually a big deal. It means more pioneers can be part of this exciting journey, regardless of how much Pi they've mined. It's all about inclusivity and getting everyone on board. This change is already having an impact. We're seeing wallets with minimum migration amounts below 1 pi starting to dominate the migration statistics. This isn't just a numbers game. It's a sign that Pi Network is successfully creating a system accessible to various user segments. But what does this mean for you? If you've been holding off on migration because your balance was below 1 pi, now's your chance to join in. It's like Pi Network is opening the doors wider, inviting more of us to be part of this exciting phase. Pi Network and DeFi, a match made in crypto heaven. 
Now, let's talk about something that's got the whole crypto world buzzing, DeFi or decentralized finance. And guess what? Pi Network is positioning itself as a key player in this space. For those of you who might be new to the concept, DeFi is all about providing financial services without the need for traditional intermediaries like banks. It's finance, but decentralized and powered by blockchain technology. So how does Pi fit into all this? Well, Pi Network is uniquely positioned to make a splash in the DeFi world. With its mobile-first approach and focus on accessibility, Pi could bring DeFi to millions of users who might otherwise be left out of traditional financial systems. Imagine being able to lend, borrow, or earn interest on your Pi, all from your smartphone. Or participating in decentralized exchanges, where you can trade Pi for other cryptocurrencies without going through a centralized exchange. These are the kinds of possibilities that DeFi opens up. But it's not just about fancy financial products. Pi Network's move into DeFi aligns perfectly with its mission of creating a more inclusive financial system. By leveraging DeFi, Pi could provide financial services to the unbanked and underbanked populations around the world. What's next for pioneers? All right, so we've covered a lot of ground, but I know what you're thinking. This all sounds great, but what do I need to do? Don't worry, I've got you covered. First things first, if you haven't completed your KYC yet, now's the time. Here's a quick checklist. Make sure you've completed at least 30 mining sessions. This shows you're an active participant in the network. Be at least 18 years old. This is a legal requirement for KYC. Comply with all Pi Network policies. This helps maintain the integrity of the network. If you're having trouble with KYC, don't panic. Some common issues include problems uploading identification documents or technical errors when using Pi Browser. If you encounter these, try using a different device or contact Pi Network's support team for help. For those of you who've already done your KYC, pat yourself on the back and start getting ready for migration. Here's what you can do. Keep an eye out for migration announcements. The Pi Network team regularly updates the community on migration progress. Make sure your Pi browser is up to date. This will ensure you have access to the latest features and security updates. Have your ID documents handy. You might need these during the migration process. Remember, whether you're just starting KYC or preparing for migration, every step you take brings us closer to the open mainnet. The road ahead, what to expect. Now, I know you're all dying to know when all this is gonna happen. While we don't have an exact date yet, the team is aiming to launch the open mainnet by the end of this year. Exciting times ahead, folks. But here's the thing, we all have a part to play in this. The more of us who complete KYC and prepare for migration, the smoother this transition will be. It's like we're all pieces of a giant pie puzzle and every piece counts. Looking ahead, there's so much potential for how we can use Pi. As new features roll out in the Pi wallet, we'll be able to do more than ever before. And with Pi positioning itself in the DeFi space, who knows what kind of financial opportunities might open up. Community matters, your role in Pi's success. One of the things that makes Pi Network special is its strong community. With over 60 million users worldwide, we're not just a cryptocurrency, we're a global movement. Your engagement with the community is crucial. Participate in discussions on the Pi Network forums or social media groups. Share your experiences, ask questions, and offer help to newcomers. By actively engaging, you're not just staying informed, you're contributing to the growth and development of the network. And let's not forget about the broader impact of what we're doing. Pi Network's mission goes beyond just creating another cryptocurrency. It's about bringing financial inclusivity to people all over the world, including those who have been left out of traditional financial systems. By being part of Pi Network, you're part of this mission. Every time you mine, every KYC you complete, every transaction you make, you're helping to build a more inclusive financial future. Addressing concerns and looking forward. Now, I know some of you might have concerns, Maybe you're worried about the security of your personal data during KYC, or you're unsure about how Pi will compete in the crowded crypto market. These are valid concerns, and it's good to be cautious. The Pi Network team takes data privacy very seriously, using high-level encryption to protect your information. As for competition, 
Pi's unique mobile-first approach and strong community set it apart from many other cryptocurrencies. Remember, every revolutionary idea faces skepticism at first. Bitcoin was once dismissed as a passing fad, and look where it is now. While there are no guarantees in the world of crypto, Pi Network's innovative approach and growing community give it a strong foundation for future success. Wrapping up, the future is Pi. As we come to the end of this update, I hope you're as excited about Pi's future as I am. From the advanced features coming to Pi Wallet to the progress in KYC and migration, from the move into DeFi to the growing global community Pi Network is making waves in the crypto world. But more than that, we're part of something bigger. We're pioneers in a new digital economy, one that promises to be more inclusive, more accessible, and more user-friendly than anything that's come before. So what's next? Well, that's partly up to you. Keep mining, complete your KYC if you haven't already, prepare for migration, and stay engaged with the community. Every action you take brings us one step closer to our shared goal of a decentralized future. Remember, the future of Pi is in our hands. Let's make it count. What are your thoughts on these developments? Are you excited about the new Pi wallet features? How do you see Pi fitting into the DeFi landscape? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. I'd love to hear from you. Thanks for watching. Until next time, keep mining, stay curious, and let's make Pi Network the best it can be. We're in this together. Pi fam.